This question asks, how are you doing post-grad? I'm not okay. Welcome or welcome back, girly, to another video with your girl, Destian. If you're new here, make sure you go ahead and click that subscribe button if you want to be one of my girlies. And if you want to support me, of course. So, as y'all can probably tell by the title, this is long overdue. I feel like y'all been asking for this video for so long and I just have not recorded it or sat down to do this video. It's not going to be long. I really expect it to be short and simple, right to the point. But yeah, as y'all can probably tell by the title, it's a life update. Um... Y'all got some questions for me and I'm going to answer them. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to leave y'all in the dust, okay? I'm not going to leave y'all just lost on what's next, okay? So, without further ado, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe to your girl's channel if you have not already. If you want to see how I did my makeup, make sure you stay tuned for the detailed makeup tutorial that I will be posting probably right after this video. So, yeah. Without further ado, girl... <laughs> Cause it's long overdue girl let's you know jump into the video okay so i asked on my instagram some i did like a poll a couple weeks ago i really don't know how long it was um and i was like you know ask me some life update questions um i didn't get that many responses which i knew i wasn't um because some people just don't care but the subscribers y'all care so i also posted it on my i posted a poll on my community and it said to basically if y'all have any questions for me or whatever y'all want to see on my channel because i was planning for august the month that we're in now and uh someone asked she um asked for me to do this sit down video and basically tell y'all my life goes what i'm doing next and what am i doing now since i've graduated college so that's what i'm going to do in this video <laughs> so going back off my poll someone asked do i want to work or go back to school and right now i am working y'all i feel like that's probably like the main question like what are you doing after college i ended college with a internship i have been working there all summer um i really like the company i really like what i'm doing um and i get to work from home so i'm trying to see if i can make that something longer than what i have now i have like two extra months that they have given me after the internship program so hopefully i can extend it even longer so that's where i'm at right now but if not god's plan is what i'm following that <laughs> like i really can't force that enough um whatever he wants me to do next that's what i'm gonna do and however long he wants me to do something that's how long i'm gonna do it i just don't really have like oh i want to work there and i'm gonna work there like of course my I want to do something is full-time influencer full-time content creator um i'm really trying to get back on my consistency for that but with working and then you know taking care of the house and taking care of my mental well-being as well as my health it's kind of hard to balance the lifestyle but i'm start starting to get into it um so hopefully you know we can have a great august and september and all the other months before we get to 2024 and maybe in 2024 beginning of 2024 i will not have to work and be a full-time influencer you know what i'm saying maybe <laughs> so but of course i do want to go back to school for my master's just because i feel like it's always important to have that degree um whether you're an influencer or not um just to have something to back up on just in case you know what i'm saying because just in case <laughs> okay so how does it feel to be in your 20s now that you're here um 20s are a little chaotic baby i feel like in your 20s you really don't know what be going on for real like <laughs> you just be here okay because i just be here okay like i wake up I go work out like I have my little routine that I follow but then again it might be some things that go on in my day and I'm just like okay like that's weird but you know 20s is just a time where you just simply going with the flow you're not really rushing nothing you're really not forcing nothing 
but it's also the time to grind like i feel like a lot of us in our 20s are grinding like crazy like we really want to be somewhere by our 30s we really want to have our life together you know what i'm saying and i'm 23 so you know that's getting a little close so we really out here grinding we're really out here striving to be our best selves and i feel like 20 is the time for you to learn yourself you for you to learn what you like what you don't like for you to learn how you like people to treat you how you don't like people to treat you for you to learn what foods you like baby like you know what i'm saying because it goes we only be having a limited amount of everything you know what i'm saying so 20 is the time to figure out who are your real friends who are not your real friends who are meant to be in your life for the rest of your life and who is meant to be there for a season and that's okay you know what i'm saying so i feel like 20s is a time that you're really growing and you're really learning about yourself and what you want next and how you want it and just how you want life to be and 20 is the time for you to set that standard so when you go on into your 30s and your 40s you can you can already know what it is what it is and what it what it's been okay since your 20s period so i feel like 20s is a great time it's a time to be alive it's a time to have fun it's the time to enjoy life and enjoy yourself of course always enjoy life even if you're older than 20 or if you're out of your 20s enjoy life period but 20 is the time for you to just you know explore explore but be safe um yeah i just feel like 20s is time for you to network it's time for you to get to know people what they doing what y'all doing that why i be asking y'all and y'all don't be responding to me so what y'all be doing over there hmm y'all be having fun well my invite you know what i'm saying it's time for you to hang out with people that you never thought you would hang out with get to know them let them get to know you if y'all fall off or if it's not meant to be then like i said people are there for a season some people are there for a lesson. Some people are there for a blessing. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. Like, life goes on. And as a person that was, you know, depressed about having friends, depressed about, like, I don't know if y'all seeing the growth, but I see the growth and it's so amazing to see my own growth. Like, I used to be sad about not having friends. I used to be sad about folks not inviting me nowhere. I used to be sad about all these things, but baby now, girl i don't need all right girl so we had to take a little break let the camera charge up but we're back at it okay take a little break had to eat too so if something in my teeth mind your business okay and it's raining really hard so if y'all hear the rain if y'all hear the thunder thundering please disregard okay we still finna get this video today today so back to the question that i was on was <clears throat> asking about how I feel to be in my 20s now since I'm here um honestly I just feel like 20 is the time that you need to figure out what you want in life and how it's really like you're setting this you're setting the tone for the rest of your life like honestly that's what 20 is giving um so yeah I feel like 20s is a fun time it's a time to learn about yourself it's a time to grow it um and if you're in your 20s right now girl please leave those relationships alone for real like i start worrying about a relationship trying to get with somebody like when i'm 25. but that's about it <laughs> so yeah um so somebody asked what's new what's new is like nothing really like i just graduated college i am back at home uh this was not my plan but i'm here i feel like that's what i need to talk about graduating college you thinking like you finna be somewhere else which some people were but for me that was not my destiny that was not what god wanted for me to happen um so yeah when i graduated college i thought oh i'm finna move away and work my corporate job somewhere else and get my own apartment and blah blah this blah blah that like that's what i thought that was my in intentions when i first graduated college but god said no ma'am um <laughs> that's not for you that's not where we're taking you for so i got an internship like i told y'all i got an internship i've been working there all summer and 
I might continue to work there because I work from home. So it's not really like anything hard for me to do. Whatever got, got next for me to go after or whatever job opportunity. Yes, I'm still applying to jobs that I really want. Yes, I'm still, you know, researching about places to live and things like that. Because, of course, I'm 23. I want to be at my mama's house. You know what I'm saying? I want to have my own place. I want to have my own space. Things like that. But at the same time, right now, God said it's not for you. So, stop trying to get something that I ain't, I ain't trying to give you. I'm not giving you that yet. I don't feel like you're ready for that. So, yeah, I'm really just on god's plan i'm on god's timing you know what i'm saying i'm praying each day for you know the things i want but still working for the things i want and saving so yeah um that's what's new really just me being at home i'm back at home back at home <laughs> like i'm back at home working like i get paid good so I don't have a problem with that. Um, so this question asks, how are you doing after, how are you doing post-grad? So I'm not okay. <laughs> I feel like everybody gonna say they're not okay, but we are okay. Well, I am okay. Um, I can't speak for everybody, but right now I'm okay. I'm, I'm understanding where I'm at right now. I'm understanding what I have going on and where I want to go. You know, I'm just writing out my dreams. I'm writing out my um, my goals. I'm writing out, you know, what I want for myself and what I see myself having in the next year or the next months. Um, so, yeah. And then I'm just trying to focus on my personal growth as well. Like mentally, physically, emotionally. I'm just working on spiritually. Like I'm working on myself throughout those things as well and i feel like that's the time throughout post-grad um it's a lot going on it's a lot of people you may see your peers that are in apartments and they're moving away and all this and that or they're going back to school and you like dang man like i should be doing some of that or i should have that but at the same time if it's not for you it's not going you're not going to have it so worry about what's for you at that time and and at this time and if i wasn't here right now my family would be having issues and i wouldn't be able to help like i am able to help right now so i'm really thankful for where i'm at um i'm understanding like i was meant to be here i needed to be here like even though i didn't want to be here i needed to be here there was there's a reason why i'm here you know what i'm saying so i feel like once we start realizing that there's a reason why we're at where we need to be in this position in this era of our life then we can start forgetting about oh i wish i had this oh i wish i had that so yeah it's a reason for me to be here so i'm here and i'm happy and i'm blessed we like to party hey. so that's basically all the questions i had going back to the main question that she asked me um what are some of my goals my life goals so my end goal for career is to open my own consulting firm as a person that has had small businesses um i always wish i had somebody that could tell me like what i'm doing wrong how i can improve in certain areas whether it's marketing um finances things of that nature so that's like my end goal is i want to open my own consulting firm um of course having employees and you know us helping smaller businesses reach their goal of course so yeah that's my end goal um career wise end goal life wise is i really just want to be happy healthy and loved like that's simple that's so simple i want to be happy healthy and loved like i just want to be in an era of my life where like my overall life goal is just to be happy and to be happy where i'm at and to be able to learn and take in so much information and still be able to use that throughout my everyday life to be able to give advice to younger kids to just be an influence um honestly to all ages like i just want to be an influence to people um i want to make a difference in this world some way somehow and whatever that way is you know i will most definitely take it up firsthand 
Um, so yeah, I just feel like my life goal is just to be happy, healthy, and in love, baby. Like, that's all I need. That's all I need. But for real, life goal, I want to do full-time content creating. Um, I feel like that is one of my main things. I really love sitting in front of the camera. I really love talking, as y'all can probably tell. Um, so yeah, full-time content creator, opening my own consulting firm, um, being financially stable, like I can buy whatever I want and still be good at the end of the day, my bills still gonna get paid. Being able to take care of my family and whatever needs that they may have or they may desire. Um, being able to support them. And yeah, I'm, I feel like that's my end goal. Like that's my life goal. Like I just want to be able to give back to my people that has been giving back to me my whole entire life. That's it. If y'all want me to do another one, y'all don't feel like I answered enough questions. That's because y'all didn't comment. But y'all make sure y'all comment underneath this video the questions that y'all want to know about my life. But yeah, you guys, that's all of the questions. I hope you guys enjoy this video. As always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to your girl's channel if you have not already. So you can be one of my girlies. Before I close out this video, I really just want to say thank y'all for all the love and support. Thank y'all for being... God, God, you don't want me to say this. I I don't think you want me to talk to y'all. Um, <laughs> but no, for real. Thank y'all for all the love and support that y'all have given me on my channel throughout my whole four years of college. I really started my channel only for college. Like, I was going to quit after her. But those four years went by so fast. And basically, a year and a half was taken away from me for from COVID. So, yeah. But I do want to introduce this new series that I am going to be using for my channel. Um, What's Next This. Um, so this is basically going to be what I'm doing day to day. Like every time I drop a vlog it's probably going to say what's, what's next this. Or any video that I post is going to be in my intro. Um, just because like we're starting a new series in life. Like I'm done with college for right now. Um, I do plan on going back like I said. But um right now i'm done with college so like what am i doing like what am i doing what's what's next in my life who i'm hanging with who i'm dating you know what i'm saying things like that you will be able to see throughout this series um and still i don't know how long i'm going to be doing this series probably until i get like probably in, probably until i get like a stable position in my life where i just feel like i'm stable enough to just do regular content and not have like a series over it um yeah but that's all i had to say um i just wanted to introduce that to y'all so if y'all see it on my screen if y'all see it in the vlogs then y'all know that we starting this new series on my channel as always thank y'all so much i love y'all and i will see y'all in my next video bye